Hey, Bart Miller here with Cycling Strong 2014 Inner Bike, and we found a new company that we think is really, really cool. Dylan's got this machine that absolutely will be taking over the hunting, fishing world because it's a way that you can get out there, get into uh, different locations, and have a lot of fun. So, Dylan, walk us through this machine. Tell us all about it. What's so hot and cool about it? Well, um, this bike is really the result of a long time doing industrial trike systems. It's meant to be doing a heavy-duty job. We're shooting for a 200 pound payload. We'll let you know if we test to it. Very new bike. Um, and that will be, will be basically limited by the, the rider's ability to balance the weight. Right. But we spec'd it out for a full mule deer. We have it set up to run off of any hub motor on the market. Any rear hub with a rear disc, you can power the bike off of. If you already own the motor and you like it, keep it. But more importantly, anywhere in the world, if you have access to old e-bikes, you can keep this one running and keep your trip going. But the real reason that we went with this system is in this particular motor, which is one of the largest on the market, and the reason that we went with it is to prove that it fits. Yeah. This is putting out 70 Newton meters of torque, which is 30% more than the stock Harley Sportster. This is still bike lane legal. It is a 100% legal electric bicycle that is not a motor vehicle under the law. You can take it right past the no motor vehicle signs, but you do get more than enough power to do useful work and get far out into the woods where other people can't get Absolutely awesome, isn't it? It is an absolute blast. This will take you anywhere in the backcountry that you need to go, and you have the cargo capacity to carry charging equipment. So cool. So really quick, obviously this thing's got disc brakes on it, full lights on it. It's got the Sela Anatomica saddle, which is absolutely, you know that we love that saddle. And uh, it's got the big fat bike wheels, so you can obviously get lower pressure if you need to to get better traction. and. I just don't know what more to say about it. It's just absolutely amazing piece of work and will be tons of fun. Hopefully one day we'll get to go out there, test this thing out. If you have any questions about it, make sure you comment below and ask those questions. We'll get them to Dylan. He can answer those for you. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, make sure you get that done. And we hope you love this amazing bike as much as we do. We'll be talking to you soon.